Is anyone else confused about the use of X in the titles of anime? Let me give you an example. Hunter x Hunter, or is it Hunter Hunter? Hunter cross Hunter? Hunter squared? Now it's not like I give a shit how it's pronounced, it's just that if I don't pronounce it one specific way, I'm gonna have fanboys and weebs on my ass about how it should be said. I'm firmly in the camp of it doesn't matter how the fuck you pronounce it, but you know, that being said, the creators of the anime don't make it easy on us either. Spy X Family. Spy family? Spy cross family would make sense because you're placing a spy into a family and the family works together. But then again, could it just be spy family because it's a spy family? I do not fucking know. I think in a lot of cases it's being used as emphasis for the two other words in the title, but holy hell do you need to make the X so prominent that it might as well be pronounced anyways? I mean, if you're gonna say it without the X in front of someone who's looking at the logo, they're gonna think you're crazy. Darling in the Franks. Decent show and it looks pretty obvious how you should pronounce it. One of the X's are silent. But I would not be surprised if someone mistakenly said both X's. Darling in the Franks. Maybe you'd actually have to have something wrong with you to be able to make that mistake. So in the case of Hunter x Hunter, <coughs> I mean Hunter Hunter, in the canon of the universe, the X is our version of a space in between words and that's fucking stupid. I know our language logic doesn't apply to fantasy worlds or even Japan for that matter, but imagine looking at a sign that sells bread and you read it, but all you see is bread x4, x sale, x2, x dollars, x per, x loaf. I would have an aneurysm just thinking about saying that out loud. Honestly, I would rather say Hunter times Hunter. Yeah, tell me the square root of Hunter, please. But you know, Spy Family and Hunter Hunter aren't the only culprits here. Kiss x sis anyone? They're fuck man, is it kiss sis? Kiss and sis? I can't even find a consensus on the most used one. Maybe it's because people don't want to openly admit they watched it. After that, you've got Gun X Sword, Inu X Boku SS, Ladies X Butlers, and Kiss X Sis all apparently are silent X's. But High School DXD? I've seen people pronounce it as DXD, DD, and DND. So tell me, are you going on a high stakes fantasy multiplayer journey or are you trying to look at tits here? There isn't even a space between the double Ds like most titles have. So what am I supposed to do if I rock up to my school's local anime club and start talking about my favorite age appropriate anime, High School DXD, but it turns out I could be pronouncing it wrong. I would be laughed out of the Spanish classroom slash anime club. Wait. Maybe that's a good thing. What confuses me the most is what do people get out of correcting someone for pronouncing the X when like 99% of the time, the X doesn't have any impact on the story of the show or how good the show is even. All right, look at this title and tell me how you think it's pronounced. Yeah, it's pronounced Wickross. What, huh? I mean, Wickross sounds way better than Wicksauce, but just spell it Wickross then. So at this point, it's safe to assume that the X's are being chosen because they just look cool, but they're really silent in a lot of cases. But honestly, I'd argue that it sounds cooler to pronounce the X in most cases, except for Wicksauce. Yeah, in the end, I think you should just pronounce it however you want to. The majority of X's and titles are there for either aesthetic reasons or for story reasons. Not sure how confusing people for decades is gonna help your story, but whatever. I don't care how you pronounce Spy X Family, Hunter X Hunter, just please don't freak out at other people for not pronouncing it the way you say it. Unless you say Darling in the Franks, then you deserve it. <laughs>